There is a substantial risk of loss associated with trading Forex, binary options, stocks, or equities, collectively, asset classes. Only risk capital should be used for trading. Trading in any asset classes is not appropriate for everyone. Past performance is not necessarily indicative of future results. No representation is being made that investors will make profits or will not sustain losses. Before trading in any asset classes, investors should consult with their professional broker, financial advisor, or financial consultant to determine whether trading asset classes is appropriate. Investors who trade in any asset classes should only do so if the capital used for this purpose represents funds that an investor can afford to lose without adversely impacting the investor's lifestyle. No trading strategy or methodology is without risk of loss. No trading strategy is risk-free and no trading strategy can guarantee profits or freedom from losses. Investors risk losing the cost to execute any transaction, including associated commissions or fees. You should carefully consider whether trading in any asset class is appropriate for you in light of your investment experience and financial resources. Any trading decisions you make are solely your responsibility and at your own risk. None of the statements or materials in the Ovoria Prime chat rooms constitute a solicitation or recommendation to buy or sell. All right, guys, uh, welcome to the Developer Insights Call. Today is Monday, November 14th, 2022. Uh, my name is Nate. I am the developer of Aero, Red Light, Green Light, and Market Maker Strand. And this call is to discuss, help you get set up, or learn how to use any of those three products. All right. So I see two out of three names I recognize. I don't recognize Sarah. Uh, but if anybody needs help getting set up or has any questions, uh, now's the time. Otherwise, we'll uh, end the call and go back to life as uh, you know, what you're doing. uh no updates so any updates we i'll put out in the group guys there are no updates red light green light still being tested there are no updates so i put out all updates in the chat as of right now there are no updates market maker still version 2.05 red light green light ea still uh in testing phase um that's it Says so he joined three days ago, still trying it out. All right, great, sir. What uh, welcome, welcome to the team. First of all, you welcome three days ago. What uh, what product did you did you sign up for? MMT. All right, great, great, great. A lot of new MMT uh, users starting to come on board, so it's good to see that. Um, but okay. Uh, for those who don't know, I updated in the chat. Uh, MMT, uh, MMT has a new partnership with Forex funded, oh, I'm sorry, funded Forex.com. So that's the uh, prop firm that um, MMT can be ran on with no issues as far as not having to worry about getting your account banned or anything of that nature. Um, and we've already had one person already pass the account, already passed the, the, the trial. So. Uh, I think he's got a couple more days left of just doing the bare minimum trading, like you know, with a 0 0.01 lot size, because he passes uh, his phase two in like one day, I believe. So he has to wait four days until he's fully funded, because he's got the five minimum trading days. So ForexFunded.com, uh, I'm sorry, FundedForex.com is the prop firm. All right. The other one is with a broker that doesn't do very well with. MMT, uh, ACAP, uh, and they have a they have a limit on how many people can or how, how many how much dollars can be used. They only allow two million dollars of capital to be utilized. So, for example, only you know if twenty people use them and get a hundred k account, uh, that's it. We, you know, so uh, because they put a limit on how many users or how many how much capital users can trade with. Uh, I decided not to share them. Plus, they work on a broker that is not necessarily the best. All right. So I decided not to share that one. Uh, working on getting some more. Uh, but as of right now, it's what we have. So that is it for it. Well, any updates, I guess you could say. You know, that was put out in the, uh, in the chat already. So 
there are no updates, new updates other now. Does anybody else have any questions? Any needs? How much risk percentage would you trip or trade should you use the two pairs on the funded challenge? Uh, I would use 0.4% risk for two pairs. So depending on the challenge and what their risk parameters are, you can look at when you select the risk per trade, it'll tell you what your daily loss is. So you can look at that and know, all right, you know, is this too much? So for example, at 0. You know, 5% risk, you know, if it says that the max stop out is 2%, then you're good. All right, you just gotta look at your max daily loss that MMT will take, all right? And then try to, you know, make sure you stay within the parameters. So for example, with fundedforex.com, they have a daily loss. You can't lose more than 8% per day and you can't lose more than 11% overall. So pretty, pretty, pretty uh, wide gap on a daily loss at 8%. Uh, so you can run, you know, MMT, you know, on two pairs at 0.4% risk for trades. What I'd recommend, uh, you know, for, you know, 0 0.3, 0 0.3 to 0.5 is the range that I recommend depending on what prop firm you are using. So 0.3% risk per trade to 0.5. All right. So the sweet spot right there in the middle at 0.4. That's what I, when, when I do, when I used to run it on, uh, prop firms, I'll run it on 0.4. I no longer run on prop firms because of what we've seen with prop firms, um, you know, prop firms, um, I would say they, they're falsely, uh, that's what we'll call it, we'll call it falsely um, lying about why they deactivate your account. For example, a lot of customers had their accounts deactivated uh, on my Forex funds and FTMO because both prop firms say that everyone that was trading MMT was copy trading. Well, their software can also see what? Their software can see that they are taking trades from the expert advisors tab. So they know that you're trading with the expert advisor and they know you're not copy trading. However, they just, their business and their job is they pay customers out based on losing challenges. So they're gonna put all the craziest rules in place and lie and manipulate accounts to ensure that you lose so they can keep your money uh, because the more money they keep, the less they pay out and the more they get to keep for themselves. All right, so that is the issue with some of these prop firms. Um, you know, it, it, it really sucks. A lot of customers, you know, passed my force funds and FTMO and uh, started making withdrawals and then all of a sudden got shut down. All right. All because of copy trading, which they weren't. All right. So we look, I've got a couple more people that have joined. All right. If you are joining, welcome to the developer insights call. Uh, we're just about ready to get off uh, because everyone here already had all the questions answered or are late. So, uh, Void Cliff, if you guys have any questions, uh, please ask. All right. Uh, otherwise, we'll call it a day. Yes, David, I do know there are some that are really uh, fun traders, but when it comes to EAs, you're going to have issues. Uh, I don't know about Maverick, but any prop firm that has one phase, uh, one phase means they have real money. I mean, you know, because if they have one phase, they typically have real accounts, which means that once you get fully funded, you're on a real funded live account. All right. Funded Forex, uh, as I mentioned earlier, Sarah, that's who we partnered with. They will not ban you. So Funded Forex is the prop firm we have partnered with. They will not ban you. You can use your, uh, you can use MMT on them. All right. Uh, nothing going on, Void. So this call again is for updates. Um, and for anybody that needs help getting set up or knowing how to use the products, arrow, red light, green light, or market maker. Uh, IMG FX. Uh, yes, most people use IMG FX. You see them in the chat. They've been using them in the chat. You know, talking about them in the chat for months with FX books and everything. So uh, they, they've been a safe broker for months. Not really sure 
Have you heard anything else? But uh, I know people that personally have, you know, $100,000, $200,000 in their account on IMGFX. All right, great, sir. Look forward to seeing your results. So far, we've had one guy that's been fully funded on, well, he's been, he's past phase two. He's just waiting his, uh, I think he got two or three more days uh, of the minimum trading days to get fully funded. And then we got somebody else that just passed phase one on funded Forex. And we got a third person that I saw in the chat that is uh, halfway done with phase one. So, so far, so good. Everyone is doing well with, uh, with funded Forex so far. And again, this only week number three, I believe this is week number three uh, with funded Forex. All right, either week number three or week number two. It was very early on. So for people to pass phase one and phase two or just phase one this fast, that's, uh, that's, that's great to hear, great to see. Anybody else? Anybody else have any questions about utilizing the software? All right, guys. Well, I'm not going to hold you guys' time. Uh, I'll see you guys in the chat if you have any questions. Um, as always, yeah. most of the time it... So, sir, the 50% rule means that if your target, for example, you have to make 10% on your account to get to phase one. I mean, to get done with phase one. So if you got a 100K account, 10% is 10,000. So all that 50% rule means is if you make more than 5,000 or 50% of your target, if you make more than that in one day, only $5,000 count. So if you make $7,000 in a day with MMT or even your manual trading or any software, only 5,000 of the 7,000 will count for the, for the, for your trial to, of you getting to or towards the 10,000. So, uh, no, most of the time it does not go higher than 50%. Um, uh, so that is the 50% rule. Uh, I can't do anything about that. That's the rule they have. All these prop firms have some type of weird rule like this to keep you from what passing. So what, you know, that's it. Their number one goal is to keep you trading. The more you trade, the more you will be less consistent. That's why people like to use MMT on it because they don't have to manually trade and the software you know, is very tight with its you know, uh, risk management parameters and it's a consistent winner and therefore people can pass and get paid out. But the 50% rule does not happen all the time. It, it, it happens on a very good day, a very volatile day uh, where the software is, um, trading a lot. I say when you run it at 0.4, 0.5% risk, as I, as I talked about, 0.3% risk, you will not see that type of return in a day just because of the risk for trade. It will shut things off early uh, because of, of the uh, the way that the trade management is set up. All right? All right, guys. Uh, if you're going to continue to trade today, make sure you trade responsibly. I'll see you guys in the funny papers. Thanks. Thank you.